Hey guys, you're Marty Geek. In this video, I have an unboxing and hands-on look of a couple cases that was sent to me by Tom Talk for the Nintendo Switch Normal Edition. Yes, they do also have cases for the Nintendo Switch Lite, but these are for the Nintendo Switch Normal Edition or regular original edition, however you want to call it. So these right here are called Twisted Blue and Twisted Orange. Um, they told me, asked me if I wanted to make a video for these and I said yes, because I, I like their cases and I usually love cases that are thin, hard, but I can also fit some games in it. And this is where these things come and, you know, come here handy. Um, here in the back, like you see there, this is how it looks. It has the shape of the Joy-Cons right here. Like you see there, it has a very cool, nice color. Pattern is from orange all the way up to, I would say this is like a magenta looking. Looks really damn cool. I like the way the colors are blended. Uh, look uh, on the sides where the zipper section is black. And look at the zipper, how cool it looks. Very well crafted. The zipper is actually wet, very well crafted. Let me take this out. And there you go. In the inside, you got some paperwork. You got some of this. Uh, I'm just going to take this out. And uh, this right here has a lanyard. Wow, this thing is hard. <laughs> okay, there you go. We took this out, and there you have it. So in the inside, you can actually fit up to 10 games right there. And let's going to see how this fits in here. There you go, nice and cozy inside. I love it. Like you see here, it also has the Joy-Cons buttons blended in engraved into the body of the of the case close it and there you have it look at that nice that looks so damn cool and the case that i'm coming from it's this one right here this is the one that i've been using for almost a year already uh, it's really cool it's from the pokemon or pikachu edition and it has you know space for a lot more games than here but like you see here this is a lot more thicker and I love these cases because they are thin. It's really hard. It's really hard. And you can still fit a whole bunch of cool games there as well. And, of course, the lanyard. You just put it right here. The material which this is built is feels really solid. Everything feels really solid here. So, here you go. You got this nice-looking lanyard. Look at that. Cool, 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 cool. It has two zippers. Awesome. Not bad. Looks really damn nice. But let's go ahead and try the blue one because I think I'm going to like the blue one more. I'm going to put it over here to the side. And here is the blue one. Twisted blue. And what I really like about this one is that, look at this. Is, it goes from like Zion all the way to blue. Look at that. Oh, freaking beautiful. You got the brand right there. And look at that, instead of being black, where the zipper section is at, is actually gray. And I love the tone of blue and gray. I love that tone. For me, I love it. So look at that, really cool. The back, of course, same as the other one. Zippers, very good quality. And there you go. This, the lanyard is also gray as well. And of course, put it here. Oh yeah, I'm gonna take this out. I gotta take this out. I'm just gonna put this over here. Awesome. So there you have it. This is how it looks. Very nice. I love the quality. The quality of this is really, really nice. And believe me guys, you can drop your Nintendo Switch. It says you can actually drop it from around four foot high and it would actually protect your Nintendo Switch. Um, I love it, you know, the material which this is done. The quality of the zippers, this looks really damn good. This one is a little bit easier to look because it's gray. Look at that. Very nice quality. I love the lanyard. Looks awesome. And I think this is a color that I'm going to be using. Which one you guys think is better? They both look really good. They both look really good. But... I love the blue and the gray combination here, so I'm going to lean a little bit towards this one. So that's where I'm going to be putting my games on. So I'm going to go ahead and take the games from this case. So here we got Animal Crossing. I'm going to put Animal Crossing there. 
We got Super Mario 3D World. We got Hyrule Warriors. Uh, Calamity. Age of Calamity. We got Paper Mario Origami King. We got, of course, uh, Phoenix Rising. Immortal Phoenix Rising. We got Need for Speed Hot Pursuit. And what is this? What's this? What's this? Mortal Kombat 11. And there you have it. Awesome. So, like you see there, you can fit up to 10 games. Five in the top, five in the bottom. No, you cannot put no cables in here. These cases are meant to be slim and very hard and nice looking. So, for me, I have no problems. The fact that, you know, I usually don't carry cables around. I charge my, my cell phone and my Nintendo Switch with the same cable. So, I really don't care. So, this is pretty damn cool. Of course, these cases, they go for around $20 to $26 because they also have a whole bunch of other designs. So, they have designs that go for around $20. And these, I believe, they're like $26 or $25. And like I said, they also have these kind of looking cases for the Nintendo Switch Lite. No, they did not send me a case for the Nintendo Switch Lite. It would have been nice if they sent me one of each. That way I could try both of them, but nope, they sent me all just for the original, and honestly, I like them, I like this, this one, I love it, love the blue one with the gray color, you got the games right there, and the switch, which looks freaking awesome, fits perfectly good in there. So guys, that's it for this video, thanks for watching, I'll leave links in my descriptions for these cases. And let me know in the comments, which one do you think is better? The blue, Twisted Blue, or Twisted Orange? I love Twisted Blue. I love it. Love it. So, guys, thanks for watching this video. Till next time. Bye-bye.